Sandy Missouri from Balloon Utopia and Market with Balloons. And today, I, I'm here on a job site, but I just wanted to tell you real quick about the video you're about to see. This is Joette Myers Giardinia, who is teaching us how to uh, seal foil balloons, what to do with foil balloons, how to fix them if you get little holes in them. Joette is from ballooncoach.com and she is a wealth of knowledge. This girl knows her stuff and I'm so excited that she's here to share some tips and tricks with us. So sit back, enjoy, learn something. Uh, you might pick up a little something here even if you're a seasoned professional. And uh, of course, make sure you smash that like button afterwards. Leave me a comment, tell me what you thought, what else you wanna learn. Share this video with everyone you know and of course, subscribe to my channel. All right, well sit back. Uh, relax, get a pencil and paper maybe, and w go ahead and watch Joette, and then go forth and balloonify. Hi, this is Joette with ballooncoach.com, and today I'm gonna talk to you about using tape on foil balloons. My favorite tape to use when working with foils to help them go onto their lines or when creating structures is the red box of Scotch brand transparent tape. And you'll see in a second how it really is transparent and you can't see it on the balloons. My favorite way to work with it is to get your standard desk tape dispenser that so you can just put the tape in and then you're easily able to put it on your table and then to pull the tape off when you need it with just one hand. I know some people prefer to work with packing tape, but this is what I've been using since I started in the industry in 2003 and it works really well for me. So for demonstration purposes, I'm going to use some red duct tape and a red piece of ribbon so that you can see my work rather than working with monofilament or fishing line. So the first thing I do is I start off right where the balloon is at and run my line. And I put my first piece of tape. Now, I take the tail of the foil balloon and roll it down. And I'll put another piece of tape. Starting from the front and working to the back of the balloon. Now, I do what a lot of times is called H taping, which is basically just a way to give you a backup. Putting one piece of tape here and then flipping it to your other side and putting one more piece of tape right there. Do you see the H? Thus, it's called H taping. <laughs> now let's say this was up in your facility and people are walking by it or there is a lot of airflow. This can spin around if you only have one attachment point. So I always encourage with stars to use the middle and the two sides for your attachment point. So I go ahead and go to that corner and then take the tape up one side and down the other. And then just like we did before, we're gonna back it up with our H taping and go across. And if you make it long, it may wrap to the other side, but again with transparent tape, nobody will see and it's totally fine. You go to your other side and put your tape again. So yes, it's a lot of tape. And I wanted you to see it in red so you understood the H and how it works. And now what we'll do is go to this last corner and I'll use my transparent tape so you can see why I like it so much and how it really does disappear into the balloon. So you go right across and down and then backing it up with your two other pieces of tape that are going across here and onto the balloon and flip it over and go again. All right, so that is how, if you're working with helium balloons, you can do what's called a string of pearls out of foil stars or make a letter banner out of letters and they're all right next to each other and it's all backed up. So don't forget to make your H. Also, you can do this air fill from the ceiling and make it like a banner of somebody's name or the numbers for their birthday, 16 or 50th. And it can hang from the ceiling with two click-click magnets. All right, well, I'm Joette 
with ballooncoach.com. I help balloon professionals around the world grow their business through a free blog on my website, an online magazine with interviews with other balloon professionals, and our monthly webinar program called Passport to Success. We have a brand new program called Premier that allows balloon professionals to have weekly support with me to help them grow their business and have access to all of our past webinars that started in September of 2015. I look forward to being your partner in success. Have a great day.